Hey everybody, AmpReparGuy.com, 203-892-4119. So we have another Ameritron AL811H here. I'll go over everything it needs that I can see. So he did that fan mod with the switch and all that, so I'll go over that to make sure everything is done right. Plate choke is damaged. There's a black spot, and I see continuity between that spot and the lead going to the plate blockers. So the magnet wire enamel's damaged. One too many turns for the coils. He said he only used this on the lower bands. He did the 10 meter mod, tried it on 10 once. He didn't ever use it on 10 and 15 other than that. So I'll unsolder one end, remove one turn for each coil. These new SO239s, these ones have like no grip. In and out, in and out, in and out. So, he left the leads, they were actually bent down, almost touching. So, these are for the old fan. I'll remove those. Take the socket assembly out, do everything I normally do under there. Put a longer screw in the base of the pleat choke. So I'm going to get to work. Also clean all the contacts with the exit gold, you know the one the input rotary switch, the band switch, remove the gas discharge tube off the board and the metal oxide various to off the board. So see you guys soon. Stay tuned. A lot of work. One other thing I forgot to point out with it on 10 the plate tune air variable capacitor is actually at maximum capacitance. So we'll have to resolve that. It should be at minimum. All right, see you guys soon. Okay, so I compressed the socket clips, added the gas discharge tubes, and grounded the grid for each tube right to the chassis metal. So I have to go get the new plate choke. I'll put the longer screw in it. So Stay tuned. Also want to make sure all these are nice and tight. The last one is in the amp. So, see you guys soon. Okay, so I'm back with the completed Ameritron AL811H. I'll go over everything I did real quick. So, tested full output on all bands. Got a brand new set of Pentalab 572B tubes. I corrected the plate tune capacitor alignment. Now, the three o'clock position where it says 10 it is at minimum capacitance and then at the nine o'clock position zero maximum capacitance socket assembly was taken out did everything you saw before brand new plate choke there's the old one Brand new SO239 connectors from Max Gain System. Now they're nice and tight. They don't pull. So, that's my phone. Removed a turn off each coil for the parasitic board assembly. Check the meter protection diode. Took the gas discharge tube off the rear board, tightened hardware up, fixed solder joints. Took the metal oxide variester off the board also. Clean the output rotary switch with deoxic gold, band switch. Clean the input rotary switch with deoxic gold. Zip tied the wiring. That's down below here. Back of this, over here. And that's about it. So if you need an amplifier repaired, feel free to give me a call. Phone number is 203-892-4119. Please like, share, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. 73.